Hello everyone, it's April 2nd. I'm going to be pulling these four bounce mushrooms out of the tank and fragging them. I'll be taking the razor blade, cutting them across their mouth, and then using the razor blade as a squeegee, trying to separate the two halves so they don't grow back into each other. Um, so, we'll uh, hit the pause button and hopefully you'll see this all come together. So I believe that the mouth is right here, so what I'm going to do is just go cut straight down. I'm going all the way to the uh, ceramic, and then I take the razor blade and I push just a little bit to the right and a little bit to the left. Just like that. That should help ensure that the two pieces, hopefully, don't grow back together. So same with this guy. Also, I'm going to have the bubbles on hopefully the left and right piece, not just no bubbles on one frag and bubbles on the other frag. So there is straight down. Cut up and down. And then you use it like a squeegee, and you just kind of push the two halves apart a little bit. Just like that. And this guy isn't going to be as easy. I'm probably not going to be able to push him apart, but I can definitely frag him still. So. I'm going to go ahead and hit pause and plop these guys in the tank. So this is the other guy. What I'm going to do is just cut him with the shears. The reason why I'm able to do this is because he is still on a little bit of a ceramic on both sides. That means I can super glue each half to a actual new frag disc without having him blow away with a lack of weight. So, let's see. No complaints there. Now all I have to do is flip it over, cut straight down, and we are in business. Uh, side note, I used my tank water, salt water, on this towel to make sure it was damp and not dry, especially not dry. Little tidbit tip right there. Well, I'm gonna go ahead and glue these on to a frag and get them in the tank. Hold, please. I also washed my hands with soap, so I know I probably should be handling these with gloves on their benefit, but I'm not going to get too technical with that one.
and there you have it. I'm going to let these guys sit for a couple minutes and then get them back in their aquarium. Um, probably take another video of them in the aquarium, compile the footage, and then give you probably a one or two week update all in one go, one video, all done. Alright, so everyone's in the tank. Very fresh, literally a couple minutes ago. I'll probably do maybe another shot tonight and show you guys what it looks like, but you have the two frags right there, top and lower. Then you have this guy. You have two halves left and right. On top you have, same thing, two left and right. Then you have these two, and they're uh, one each. Total of eight frags. And there's also a baby growing, so there's a little bonus thrown in somewhere. All right, about 24 hours after the initial cut, everything went pretty well. Um, gluing to the frags was a little bit more difficult than anticipated, but it all turned out all right. Everyone's healing up pretty good. There aren't any signs of anything going wrong. Um, I'd say all but one of the frags looks like they're going to heal completely separate other than from their other half. Except for this one in the middle. Um, we, we'll see about that one. I can't really show you guys through the top of the tank very well and make it clear. But so far uh, everything's going as planned. I'll give you guys an update once it's about been a week. Alright, well here we are about two weeks and everything's been doing pretty good. Got the two frags on the right, got six frags on the left, and a baby. So that's nine bounce mushrooms in total. Um, overall pretty happy. Um, I did take one of the frags out, I think it was probably that guy that the hermit crab is taken off I took him out about a week ago and just gave him a little bit more of a slice on the edge just to make sure that they um, separated the, the way I wanted and didn't grow back together turned out good really happy with that um, so as these start growing you know they're decent sizes already but I'll be uh, letting them grow out a little bit maybe selling some to some friends, we'll see. I do have some friends interested in this guy, so once he continues to grow out, I'll be probably making a video on fragging in OG Bounce Mushroom. Um, you know, we will see. And uh, as far as everything else goes, it's going smoothly with the tank. I'd really like to know what you guys think and have your comments. So, you know, feel free to drop a comment in the comment section and like the video. Subscribe if you want to see more. And I'd be very interested in getting some comments from subscribers on what you want to see in the tank, what you want to know about the tank, and uh, so on and so forth. So, anyways, you know, enjoy the hobby.